TJ, thank you. New tonight, a Rhode Island state police trooper is recovering after police say a drunk driver hit his cruiser while he was inside of it. 12 News reporter Brittany Schaefer spoke to state police tonight. She joins us live now with more on what happened and how this holiday weekend is shaping up. Brittany? Chelsea police tell me it was the exact situation they were hoping to avoid. They say the state trooper had pulled over into the right lane here to assist another trooper during a DUI stop to offer him protection, but then he was hit. A Rhode Island state police trooper is injured, his cruiser heavily damaged. The whole rear end is pushed in. Lieutenant Charles Lavallee says 36 year old Maxime Gorbachev slammed into the back of a state police cruiser on Route 95 North near the 146 split. He tells me the trooper had stopped to offer assistance to another trooper who was conducting a DUI stop. And he was in a bad area, so the trooper was backing him up, giving him light so nobody would hit him. And we were trying to avoid that, and unfortunately, you know, we get this a lot with the drunk drivers. The Pawtucket man then tried to leave the scene of the crash and hit the cruiser for a second time. Gorbachev was arrested and is suspected to have been driving under the influence but refused to take a chemical test. We try to prevent it from happening to one trooper, the other trooper behind him to try to make it safe, and then he ends up getting hit. And it should not happen, but unfortunately it does. The trooper was evaluated at Rhode Island Hospital but has since been released. Lavallee says they typically see an increase in drunk driving over long holiday weekends. He tells me the rain has lessened traffic, but surprisingly that isn't helping. We've had more accidents than we normally have due to the weather. Uh, in, a, in a four hour span yesterday in the metropolitan area, we had 12 accidents. And the Valley says state police will release DUI data tomorrow afternoon for this weekend. He does tell me there have been multiple DUI arrests on both Friday and Saturday for this weekend. He also adds the state police do have extra patrols out this Memorial Day weekend. For now, live in Providence, I'm Brittany Schaefer, 12 News.